First at 5.30 tonight, a Woonsocket woman is arrested after police say she left her dog in a steaming hot car. It's a story we first brought you on Eyewitness News at noon, and police say the temperature inside that car reached 100 degrees, but that's not the only sign of animal neglect they uncovered. Eyewitness News reporter Shantae Lands has the new details from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. A dog left for dead inside a hot car landed him at this Woonsocket animal shelter and his owner in jail. It's been nearly 48 hours a good boy, huh? since animal control officer Doris Kay rescued this guy from a hot car. He was cherry red. His ears were swollen shut. His gums between his feet. He was rashed all over. Obvious signs of heat. Woonsocket police say they received a phone call around 6 p.m. on Sunday from a tow truck driver. The driver says he was called in for a vehicle lockout, but when he arrived, there was a car with no owner. But this pit bull was laying inside. Hello, baby. <laughs> baby, as Kay affectionately calls him, since she never learned his name. Woonsocket detectives were able to confirm that the car was registered to a woman named Keisha Davis. He found her to be the owner of the dog also. Detective Jamie Payone says Davis was arrested and charged with unnecessary cruelty to animals and mistreatment of animals. According to court records, Davis pled not guilty at her arraignment on Monday. Davis is not alone. Detective Payone says her team handles a couple of cases every summer. It's awful. It's terrible. Um, you know how it is when you get into your car after being sitting in a parking lot. It, it's hot in the car. You don't have, need a book. You don't need Channel 12 to tell you that don't leave your dog in a car. It's common sense. It's hot for you. Of course it's going to be hot for your animal. Doris Kay says the dog will remain at this animal shelter until the courts make a decision. Reporting with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Shantae Lands, Eyewitness News.